guys welcome to my channel i'm jordine if you're new here today's video is going to be a sephora haul so if you're interested in all the products that i picked up and keep on watching i got my box of goodies i put everything in this one box because i was gonna bring three boxes down here but here we are i made two separate orders during this spring promo situation and these are the items that i picked up pretty boring but this is the first thing that i'm picking up out the box this is the sephora collection organic cotton pads i like these i've gone through numerous numerous packs of this so i just re-upped on this because i use it for my toner and i love it and i use it for my eye makeup remover it's pretty easy i think it's four dollars not sure but everything will be linked down below so the next items that i have here are the fenty cream products i have the cream bronzer in the shade chocolate and two cream blushes in the shades summertime wine and daiquiri dip i just finished filming that video so you guys will see that soon the next product is the patrick ta major brow shaping wax you guys know i love me a feathery brow so i had to pick that up i have it in the tinted shade let me just show you what this packaging looks like because it's so sleek. I got fingerprints on it because I used it. But it's so cute. I love it. So randomly, I picked up the Wishful. This is in my second order. Um, Wishful Chin Lift from Huda. Like this is her skincare brand. So Wishful. And it's supposed to have a lifting effect. and enhanced jawline with a sculpted appearance as well as hydration. So look, we gonna try this out and see if we can, you know, shape this double chin right here. Like, just, just, just suck it up. <laughs> okay. And while we're in skincare, I'm gonna show you guys this. These are from the brand Innisfree. I think it's a Korean brand. And I picked up the Hydrate and Cleansing Foam. Um, oh, it's sealed, I can't smell it. But that's what it looks like. It's pretty big, I think this was $10 yeah so it's pretty big i'm gonna get used from this it's a hydrating cleansing foam so hopefully it doesn't have a lot of fragrance to it um it's supposed to be a refreshing and hydrating cleansing foam with jeju green tea okay so it's supposed to remove makeup so that's good that's good i'm not mad at that and then the next thing i have is the dewy glow jelly cream i want to see this one so this um jelly cream is supposed to be a clear gel cream that delivers abundant hydration to dry and dull skin for a moist and revitalized look sounds good to me um so that's the packaging isn't this cute this is cute do i want to open this now i don't like opening my skincare if i'm not using it so i'm not gonna open it sorry but that's that's what the packaging looks like okay so next thing that we have that i'm pretty excited about is this new foundation from giorgio armani it's the neo nude true to skin natural glow foundation <laughs> and that's what it looks like i picked it up in the shade 13 i hope this is the right shade let's swatch it let's see it's probably the wrong shade oh wait it might be the right shade has a bit of a fragrance to it this is like that's the packaging it's pretty cute right and then look at the bottom it has like skin tone shade 13 that's what shade 13 looks like i think that will work for my face quite fine yep Ooh, i like the finish of it on the back of my hand i think i'm gonna like this one the next foundation that i picked up because you guys know i'm a foundation junkie was finally the Shiseido Synchro Skin Self Refreshing Foundation. Um, everybody and their mom raved about this foundation. And I, the reason that I didn't pick it up when it first launched was because the shades, I feel like I'm in between. And I just couldn't figure out my shade every time I looked at it online. So I went for 510 and I feel like it's gonna be a little yellow, but I can finesse it. Um, so let's see what 510 looks like. Oh, it's just so cute. Like it twists to open it. Let's see. Oh, it's very liquidy. So 510. Okay, so the undertone is pretty good, but I feel like on my face, it might it might come out a little light. Um, but you know, I can finesse that with 
it blends right into my arm but i can finesse that with like contour and bronzer so the undertone is good which is good i hate when like things are too red so we'll try that out pretty soon okay and then next in the complexion category i have the hourglass concealer this is the vanish concealer in the shade maple if you watch my recommendations video then you heard my story about how we we're supposed to get this but i decided i want to pick it up because i want to try it but that's what maple looks like i i tried this on clients so i know that it's a pretty good concealer so i want to try it on myself and i'll let you guys know my thoughts okay then i also picked up this milk kush triple brow pen so it's like one of those korean pens with like the free markers can you see that that's what it looks like so it's supposed to give you like microbladed brow effect feathery brow effect you guys know i'm all about that so we'll try that out soon let me see the color Ooh, i think the color is pretty good hold on okay so that's the color i think the color is pretty good i don't know i'm gonna have to have a learning curve with this one because i feel like that was a lot of product that came out and then last but certainly not least we got some things from auntie pat i picked up the lust gloss in the shade peach perversion i want it full real but i feel like it was sold out like when i was ordering this or i didn't see it i don't know what happened and i didn't get it but this one is peach perversion this is cute that's what it looks like I'm still going to get it for real though. I think I'm just going to order that one. And I also wanted the uh, Artist Couture Uncensored Lip Gloss, but it's sold out. It's sold out. <sighs> okay. And then... <laughs> this is my first Mothership palette. Can you believe that? My first Mothership palette. You guys, I feel like I just did something so bad. Because I know, I know once I try this, I'm going to try to buy all the mothership. I, I just know that I'm going to do that. But let's see what happens first. But this is Mothership 5. Um, what's the name of this? The actual name. Hold up. Oh, I have to keep this packaging. So the actual name of this palette is... Isn't it like Bronze Ambition or something? Isn't that the name of it? Why am I like blanking on the name of this palette? Mm, okay the actual name is bronze seduction mothership five so this is what it looks like this one is weighty okay it better be weighty for all that money that i paid for it and that's the bag <laughs> i'm about to cry y'all don't understand like i'm li literally like tearing up i'm crazy like i'm a makeup lover so you guys you'll understand if you are a makeup collector oh my god girl don't mess up your makeup don't cry um this is the palette this is what it looks like oh my god it's it's so pretty i've seen this in person because i had pat mcgrath in my older store but you know when you actually hold it and it's yours you know it's your palette oh, we are about to get some use out of this y'all got to be get tired of me showing this palette on camera but this is what the palette looks like oh i'm so happy <laughs> so all right guys so that's gonna be it for everything that i picked up during the spring promo for sephora um i'm sure most of you guys know if you have been following me but i do work for sephora so i don't really get a spring promo so i did take out some stuff out of my car because i wasn't trying to wild out okay like that's doing too much so all the other stuff like my brow pencil and things like that i'll get it later um because i have backups of some stuff anyway so i'll be fine but that's gonna be it for today's video let me know what you picked up i'm very interested in knowing what you guys got during the sale um of course keep an eye out for videos on these items and that's gonna be it for today's video so i'll link everything down in the description box down below if you're interested in trying anything out but if you like the video please give it a thumbs up because it helps me out and hello i'm jordine if you're new here please go ahead and subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys in the next video bye